Hi guys and good morning. Welcome back to our channel. We are up early today. We have to take Bella to go get some shots um, because we are going to kennel her when we go on our cruise next month. So I had to, I was a little behind on our shots so I um, am catching up on those right now. Ooh, so that's what we're doing. Huh. I don't know where your shoes are though. We're at the vet and Bella's a bad girl. <laughs> that puppy, that cute. silly. That's a bad girl. Who's a bad girl, Belle? I am. I'm a bad girl. Okay, so she's gonna have the full chances on for two hours, but let's see. It's done. Alright, we are at Starbucks now. I am going to get a tea, but, um, I'm super dark. You're hungry? Okay, well, I'll make you something to eat when we get home. Um, I'm going to take Soy to the park in a little bit when we get home, but right now I'm going to grab a green tea, which I haven't had in, like, two to three years because I think I was having an allergic reaction to it, and my mom kind of freaked me out about it and was telling me that, um, She's an RN, and she says if you are having a minor allergic reaction to something and you keep putting it in your body, that it could build up to where basically, like, your body flips out. It can flip out at some point, and just, like, it could be pretty serious. So that kind of freaked me out. I stopped having it. So I'm going to try my luck and see if um, it causes the same reaction that it was before. Um, it was very mild, but still enough to notice because it was in my throat. <laughs> so not something I want to play with. Can I get started with you? Hi, um, could I get a venti iced green tea? Do you want a sweetened? Um, could I get two sweet and low, please? And extra ice? Uh -huh. <clears throat> oh my god. <laughs> Alright, anything else? Um, could I get extra ice in that also? Of course, anything else? Nope, that's it. Thank you. Anyway, so, um, I was saying that's not something that I really want to play around with, but I do want to see if it still affects me or maybe it went away. I don't know. I'm hoping it did. Um, so we'll see. I know, baby. Thank you. Man, we're so close. <laughs> I hate when that happens. I know. Like, I'll get charged and we'll be like five cents close. Well, and I'm, I'm used to thinking the cheap because they used to be like two fifteen when I used to get them all the time, oh, and yeah. so I was just thinking, oh, I have enough. <laughs> right. Which is funny, right? Yeah. Thank you, you so much. Day? You too. We're home and so far I feel pretty good. I don't feel like it's messing with my throat at all. So maybe I can drink it now. <laughs> I'll let you guys know. But I'm about to do a little bit of cleaning in here, get some dishes done and just kind of straighten up. I should do my floors, but <laughs> I don't know if I'll do that. And Soy and Daddy are in the backyard. Rice cleaning up the yard. He's gonna mow it and stuff. Because he had to get up early to help me take a bell. Um, and now he's up, so he has some time. My camera lighting is really off today.
It's always in the shower with an eye. And I'm going to eat some of my leftover Olive Garden, which is going to make me feel absolutely disgusting. And I know I'm going to regret it, but I'm going to eat it. Um, I don't know if I'm going to be able to go to the gym tonight. I'm going to try, but my mom goes to the gym on Mondays too. So either I go earlier than her or after, but then that makes her pretty tired. So um, I'm not sure yet. Um, but I'm going to eat a little bit of this and I don't know how much more cleaning I'm going to do today. Kind of over it and I wanted to take Soy to the park and it's kind of more important than cleaning. Um, I think I'll vacuum though. Vacuum a little bit. I just don't know if I'll get to my floors. But anyways, um, we went to, me and Rai had a date night last night which... Um, I think we've been on four date nights since Sawyer has been born, which is unacceptable, honestly. Um, it's something that we, it's something, it's something that we really need to work on. We were talking last night about, like, because of the amount that we see each other, like, it's literally just in passing, like, hi, bye. Um, it just like we just need to focus on at least doing one date night a month there's no reason that we shouldn't be setting that side setting that time aside for our marriage because um you know i'm just constantly focusing on being a mom and keeping up the household and he's concentrating on working his butt off like he does so much to provide for his family and we're just in our own little worlds you know and it's just it's so i don't want to our marriage to get in a rut I want to be able to we've known each other since we were kids you know and so it's like we don't really have even that time for that friendship anymore and so we were talking last night saying that it's something that we need to make a priority there's should be no excuse to not do it so we had a really fun time last night even though we missed soy the entire time it just like at one point I was gonna text my mom and be like hey you know what I'm just gonna come pick him up but I didn't and I'm glad I didn't because if I did then my attention would have been completely on soy and not on us so we got to go to dinner last night and like you know flirt and like just connect like we we don't really get the opportunity to and then um yeah and then we drove around we wanted to go to some stores but they were all closed because it was Sunday so we drove around and even just driving alone together was nice you know and then we picked up soy and we were really excited and went and got milkshakes so i'm eating my leftovers because if you've ever been to olive garden when you're done with the soup and the breadsticks like i took two bites of my meal and that was it so i'm eating it now so good but Oh my gosh, so good. <laughs> but it's like drenched in in grease. See it? Oh man. That's just a that sucks. It sucks that I'm still gonna eat it too. I had to get Belle a four gallon water dispenser because she goes through water like insanely fast. The vet said she probably has diabetes. Um so this thing, this is a mission to fill up and put back on her dish. But, gotta do what you gotta do. And they said if she did have diabetes, they'd have to put her on insulin, which is like something insane, crazy expensive. So, obviously we can't do that. But, um, other than that, she seems pretty darn healthy. I'm gonna board her, like I said, for the first time. I've never bored her before because she is dog aggressive. So, I'm like super nervous about it, hoping it's gonna be okay. But they assured me that she shouldn't be near any other dog so but my mom has her sister which she um will be there too so maybe they'll be next to each other and at least i don't know maybe that'll make it a little bit better or something huh Belle? huh oh girl you so old you treat? what okay we're back in the car um i did some more cleaning uh, you can't have that in here, baby. You can have it when we get to Gammy's. Um, I did some more cleaning, and then me and Zoe kind of just laid around for a little bit and spent some time with Rye before he went to work. We didn't make it to the PARK, but um, that's okay. I'll take him tomorrow, hopefully. 
but um so his grandma called and so he calls her gammy we're gonna go over to her house right now but i'm thinking i need to stop at starbucks and i know that i don't i mean like i'm sure we've all seen the memes all over instagram like about this topic but they are literally me like every single time that i leave the house i am convinced I need iced coffee and I know that I don't so I'm trying to talk myself out of it but I didn't have one today I had tea so I mean obviously I made my coffee in the morning but like I just iced coffee is different it's more magical it just does the job better I get something out of it that I don't anywhere else it comforts me you know so I think I just talked myself into it after trying to talk myself out of it here we go to Starbucks. <laughs> who, who let the dolls out? Who? Who? Who let the dolls out? Who let the dolls out? Who let the dolls out? Oh! Are you okay? Yeah, you crashed. Since the car, I've changed some gears. So it should be a lot faster. Are you ready to go? No. Give it all to Scott. Who let the dolls out? 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 We gotta get some wins and uh, so we can keep going for the next six races. So that's where we're at right now. Are you hiding? Don't lie. Are you hiding? <laughs> home let's focus we are home um we spent a couple hours at my mother-in-law's house and now soy is getting ready to take a bath i'm coming baby because he played really hard over there and by the time we left he was a sweaty mess so he, he keeps telling me i got itchies from grandma's house which sounds bad but he's just talking about um like he got sweaty and now he is itchy so I'm gonna start a bath over him. Here for him. Rinse it out a little bit. Okay. Whew. And I always turn on this little heater when he takes a bath. That way it's nice and cozy in here for him. And I got rice laundry to do right here. And this is what bath looks like with a toddler boy. No more, okay, babe, that's enough. Okay, one more. Ay, ay, ay. One more, choose wisely, one more. <laughs> so I told him no more trucks could go in, so he said, okay, then those, these ones are just gonna wash. <laughs> Silly. I changed into my jammies. Ooh, girl, Rye is lucky he's not home because I'm I'm looking too too dolled up here. Definitely not one of those moms that always has like the matchy tops and bottoms. I just feel like they're always like so stinking cute. Like I always see the moms on YouTube with like their cute matchy jammies, and I'm just always thinking like why why don't I look like that when I go to bed? But. I think in the past, every time I've bought jammies that look like that, that look really cute and well put together, they end up coming off because they're just too tight to sleep in, they're just too constricting, and I, I just prefer a baggy shirt, because usually the pants come off anyways, because girl, no. Too much, too much for night. Um, but this was one of the things that I got soy for Christmas, and he loves them. He has so much fun for them, and I don't turn my bath a color which I was really really worried about because as you can see everything's white yeah you're gonna get one are you excited yeah um, 
so I was really nervous the first time I used these. They did not turn my bathtub, thank God, because Rye would have divorced me. So I'm going to give him one of these. Which color do you want, baby? I want, um... What color do you want? Huh? See? Hold on. Wait, baby, wait, baby, wait, baby. Let's show them. Can't really show them. But here. A couple. There you go. Pick. Pick some. Well, which ones are you taking? But these ones. Okay, take those ones. Even though I don't think we're supposed to take three. Whoa. Lots of colors. Lots of colors. That's How cool. Yeah, hopefully you don't turn your truck's colors. Rainbow bath, rainbow bath. Love it. Are you so itchy? No? Good. Alright guys, we are going to call it a night and finish getting ready for bed. So, Yay. thank you guys so much for hanging out with us today. If you liked the video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you want to see what me and this goofball have going on in the next video, so please subscribe. And we will see you guys later. Say bye guys. Bye guys. Say bye guys like you mean it. Bye guys. Bye guys.